Talk about madness. The shots you're about to see are madness with a purpose. JPE teacher Peter Malo not only makes it look easy, the former All-State and college basketball player makes it sound easy. Oh! Told you. How many times do you have to take a shot before it goes in? It, it all depends. It's kind of based upon feel. Some days they go right in. Do not play this man in a game of horse. How many times did you practice the one where you threw it over the fence? I had about 10 minutes to work with, so I got, Come on. I got shots up for about 10 minutes. You, you practiced yep. that for only 10 minutes 10 and minutes. got it in. Yep. Is that luck or uh, is that feel? I think it's a combination of both. It looks like luck. Yep. yep. It went in though. <laughs> <laughs> He's been putting up trick shots in Shay's gym for years. Oh! First for fun, then by request. See where the, the cheerleader, the pom-pom is on the right-hand yeah. side of the torch? All right, so when you step with your left foot, stay in a perfect straight line. Like, walk up into it. There you go. <laughs> Let me try just a regular half court. <laughs> Can't even hit the backboard. Now he wants to turn the fun into a fundraiser. He hopes to get some national exposure to attract some cash to spruce up the Raiders gym and other athletic facilities. They need a level playing field. We have some great athletes. You know, our basketball team went undefeated with 18 and 0. We always have a competitive soccer team. Football team won the Super Bowl. And he hopes the more people who see those shots, the better chance he has to prompt some improvements here in Pawtucket. More information online at WPRI.com. In Pawtucket, Walt Buto, Eyewitness News. That is some impressive stuff, but I think Walt should uh, stick to his day job.